sized uh, benefit for the American people, and, and we've got to get it done. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I want to ask you about something that's in the news a lot right now. Um, you've been really prolific over the past few years being the head of the Intel Committee, and you defended, promoted, you even read into the congressional record the Steele dossier. Um, and we know last week the main source of the dossier was indicted by the FBI for lying about most of the key claims in that dossier. Do you have any reflections on your role in promoting this to the American people? Well, first of all, whoever lied to the FBI or lied to Christopher Steele should be prosecuted, mm -hmm. uh, and they are. Uh, and <clears throat> unlike in the Trump administration, if they're convicted, they should go to jail, not be pardoned. Mm -hmm. uh, so Donald Trump pardoned Roger Stone for lying. He pardoned Michael Flynn for lying. Uh, if people lied to the FBI, they should go to jail. Um, but at the beginning of the Russian investigation, I said that any allegations should be investigated. We couldn't have known, for example, people were lying to Christopher Steele. So it was proper to investigate them. And let's not forget what we learned in that investigation. We learned that the Trump campaign chairman, Paul Manafort, was giving internal polling data, campaign polling data, to Russian intelligence while Russian intelligence was helping the Trump and campaign. And to be clear, he was fired halfway through the campaign. Well, he may have been fired. Yeah. But the, the effort to get Russian help continued and even beyond the effort to get Russian help. But you the may have spread Russian disinformation get... yourself for years by promoting this. I think that's what Republicans and what people who entrusted you as the Intel Committee chair are so confused about your culpability in all of this. Well, I completely disagree with your premise. Uh, it's one thing to say allegations should be investigated, and they were. Mm -hmm. It's another to say that we should have foreseen in advance that some people were lying to Christopher Steele, which is mm -hmm. impossible, of course, to do. But, but let's not use that as a smokescreen to somehow shield Donald Trump's culpability for inviting Russia to help him in the election, which they did, for trying to coerce Ukraine into helping him in the next election, mm -hmm. which he did. Uh, into inciting an insurrection, uh, insurrection, which he did. Um, none of that is undercut. None of that serious misconduct is in any way diminished by the fact that people lied to Christopher Steele. No, I think just your credibility is. Well, I think the credibility of your question, the credibility of your question yeah. uh, is in doubt. All right. I have a question. Yeah. Uh, you're, you're a member of the, the House Select Committee investigating the January 6th 